Hello everyone, welcome to the video lecture series of Drilling Engineering. Today we are going to discuss part 2 of chapter 1 which is hoisting systems. Now by hoisting, the term hoisting means that we uh, the lowering and raising of the tubulars in, in the well bore and out of the well bore. Now in order to drill the hole, in order to change some components, subsurface components, we need to raise and uh, lower the um, tubulars time to time. Hoisting system mainly consists of three components. The first one is a derrick, second one is a draw work, and the third one is a block and tackle system. So here in this picture, uh, this one, this structure is known as a derrick. Now derrick is nothing work over an oil well. Uh, it is a structure over an oil well that allows the drilling machinery to be raised and lowered. Now coming on to the draw work. Actually, draw work, what, what it does is that it provides the hoisting and breaking power to lower and lift the heavy load of drill string and casing into the wellbore and out of the wellbore. You must have flown kites in uh, in your childhood and so you must have keys to, uh, to control the kite, to control the speed of kite, to height of the kite. So you can think of a draw work similar to that cherky. See here, this this uh, this actually this structure rolls and allows drill, uh, drilling line to get over the tubulars in order to uh, lower the tubulars into the well bore and it also has a braking system uh, which means that when when we need to stop we can apply uh, apply these brakes in order to stop the uh, stop the uh, lowering of the tubulars in the well bore now coming on to the block and tackle system what block and tackle system is so basically a system of two or more pulleys with a rope between them or multiple ropes between them is known as a block and tackle system it is uh, it is used for uh, for lifting the heavy loads now in uh, here here in hoisting systems block and our block and tackle system consists of a ground block traveling block a hook a fast line at that line now what each of them uh, functions is ground block and traveling block is nothing but of uh, a frame which consists of multiple pulleys between them in, in them a ground block is at the top of the derrick and a traveling block is below the ground block and in between ground block and a traveling block there are multiple lines multiple drilling lines I am talking about these drilling lines two three four these drilling lines and this this all the, this whole structure is known as a crown block and this structure is known as a traveling block now actually drilling line comes from the draw works the drilling line which is coming from the draw works to the first pulley of crown block that line is known as a fast line this line this line is known as a fast line and the last line uh, which is going to the deadline anchor this one this is known as a deadline now it is it is known as a deadline because it is always static it doesn't move at all but our fast line is always constantly moving so that way it is known as fast and uh, the deadline is known as a deadline now in below the traveling block there is a uh, there is an element called hook this is a hook this hook carries all the weight of the rig, means all the tubulars, all everything which is going into the well board is connected through this hook. So, uh, now one more element is there which is known as a deadline anchor. Deadline anchor uh, is nothing but a provide a static, static, uh, static, what we say, support to, to, the, uh, to the deadline. It also has a it helps it also measures the hook load. It also has a uh, machinery which used to measure the hook load. Now uh, here you can see that uh, if total hook weight ho hook do then the drilling line tension is W by four W by four. How this W by four is coming? Uh, why not four into W? Why not W by eight or um, every? Uh, why why not any other thing? this we have uh, this we have explained in another video uh, which i have shared the link in the caption you can go over that link and watch this video to uh, to get a better understanding that how the physics of this pulley works 
you must have uh, read you must have done the hc verma's monkeys and police problems so it will be easier for you to understand this as well it's not a it's not just in any rocket science so i have shared the link in the caption you can go to the that link and uh, watch how this physics works uh, and yes this is everything basically how hoisting system works in drilling rigs and uh, we'll meet in the next video thank you so much